Gross. Today is the day that we have all been waiting for. We are launching Operation Barbarossa. Let's hear According what the General's to the got operational say. plan, we advance along three corridors: northern, central, and southern. This will protect our flanks from the maneuvering Soviets and let us strike all the principal locations of the Western Soviet Union. We'll capture both administrative and industrial centers. Boring. I need some action. The Soviets don't expect the invasion. Therefore, we must capitalize on that. I like the it. initial stage of Operation Barbarossa will set the pace for the rest of the offensive. The Russians command superior numbers in both vehicles and manpower. They cannot be allowed to regroup and mount a defense. Darian? We're approaching the Rubicon. If we attack the USSR, it's win or die. Exactly. Either we crush the Russians quickly, yes. or they will overwhelm us with their numbers. The Blitzkrieg tactic has worked well for us previously, but the territory we'll have to capture is incomparable to the small pickings of Western Europe. The Wehrmacht has never faced such a task before. Do I hear a, a, a bit of doubt in your voice, Guderian? Perhaps you need some re-education. Let's go. I have signed Directive 21. We attack the Soviet Union on the 22nd of June. Why is there no more the Goring plot? I have not heard anything about the Goring plot lately. At last, the time has come to commence Operation Barbarossa. It's long overdue, let me tell you. The mm. Soviets have been getting bold these last few years. I've seen it. I'm sure the Wehrmacht will smash right through their outdated defenses. I agree. We are well prepared for the invasion while the Soviet combat radius keeps deteriorating. Besides, our diplomatic service has old man Stalin convinced we are his staunchest allies. If our armies can quickly breach the enemy defenses and gain momentum, this campaign will be no more than a military exercise. Gentlemen, you are correct. But the devil is always in the details. The Soviets have a huge advantage in material resources, and their reserve may as well include the entire population of the USSR. Not to mention the fact their leadership barely gives a second thought to casualties, whether among civilians or the military. If we make a misstep, the Blitzkrieg becomes a trench war, and that is where the Soviets will simply outlast us. The scale of the operation is a different beast entirely. The first phase of Operation Barbarossa requires the capture of Western Ukraine, Belarus, and Lithuania. We're Easy. looking at endless forests, swamps, rivers, thousands of square kilometers of the most nightmarish cross-country you can imagine. During this operation, we'll need to capture Brest-Litovsk, Bialystok, Baranovichi, Minsk, Lutsk, Rovno, Lvov, Ternopil, Kaunas, and finally Vilnius. Our offensive will be supported by our allies' troops, Italian, Hungarian, and Romanian. Romania has lots of issues to settle with the Russians, so its troops should be very eager to serve as a polite reminder. One more thing. According to our intelligence network, a large part of the Soviet Air Force is currently located on airfields close to the border, the northwestern, western, and southwestern one. There is practically no anti-aircraft defense there, a great opportunity to destroy the enemy planes on the ground before they can take off. I've heard that before. That is before. most opportune. Practically none. Thank you for the timely update. We must not let this information go to waste. Do not forget, gentlemen. Under no circumstances may we lose momentum and stop pushing forward. The German economy cannot bear the weight of a protracted war against the Soviet Union. All right, bros, we've got a pretty damn major army. The largest one is in the south. I guess we got little, like three little armies. So the major one is in the south. It got a ton of ground to cover. We got the center one where I put most of my best troops because we got to go through Brest which I'm sure is heavily defended. And then we got the smallest of the uh, little army groups in the north.
So what I want to do real quick, we got tons of points starting out. I want to do a little bit of recon before we go barreling in here. All right, recon all along the front shows a shitload of bunkers, especially around Brest. Just a crap ton. This looks, I mean, kind of lightly defended. Well, let's start in the south. Try to get the these Soviets bunkers have out. put up serious fortifications along their western border. I was just the talking Stalin about line that. And the Molotov just, line yeah, may yeah, pose I a noticed. serious obstacle for our advancing army. But it won't. No obstacle can stand up to the might of our tanks. Preach it, We've Gudarian. proven it time and time again over the last few years. Preach. In that case, get out there and prove it again, Heinz. Destroy those fortifications and clear the road into the heart of the USSR. What's up with Meinstein? We're like day one, five minutes into the campaign. He's already complying. I'd be like a little bitch if you ask me. I don't know. Maybe, uh, maybe there's... A better general out there for this operation. Maybe I appointed one of the wrong generals. Before we move into this city here, I think what we need to do is bomb these airfields like we were told to. I do what I'm told. I'm a military man. I, I, I follow the chain of command. Ha! It seems the Soviets ha. were in such a rush to retreat that they left their vehicles for us to capture. Ha. According to the latest reports, this is the case along the entire front line. Every victory brings us rich trophies. I, I was just telling frickin' Rommel right before we went in here that I wanted rich trophies. So there's that. Give me all your rich trophies, please. All right, Southern group, are you ready to go in here? Too many damn forts to start. Holy shit, that does... Damn! What's up with all... taking all that damage? I thought you guys were a little bit better than this. I was expecting a little bit more out of you guys. Your artillery is no match for mine, though. Get the shit out of there. No line of sight. Oh, we'll, we'll hunt you down, guy. General, the Soviets have three times our entire tank corps. Oh, now right Guderian's now they are scattered complaining. and in disarray. We must capitalize on this situation. If they regroup, we will lose thousands of troops. Your suggestions? We need to cut down on the number of enemy tanks immediately. Large armored units are currently located in Bialystok yeah. and Lvov. I recommend we strike at them as soon as we can. Agreed. I hereby authorize this little tank hunt of yours, but make sure it does not delay the invasion. Wow. Um, okay, so we got to go destroy a bunch of tanks here and uh, also up here. Got it. I'm kind of busy doing a little bit something else right now. If you could just just hold on a little bit. Damn, they got another big gun there. I'm kind of in the middle of something. I might Guderian drill that guy. I don't need to. Well, so far, I'm happy. Hold on, since we need to go... Since we do need to go down there, I think we probably need to do some more recon of the area. So there's a bunch of tanks down here, you say. Is that true? Holy shit! I thought if I took the planes off the airfield, there wasn't going to be any. There, there's already a shitload. I am confused. I'm sure the, the Romanian, Hungarian, and Italian bros can... Uh, take care of all that, though. I'm very confident in their skill sets. 
So the breast attack might be a little bit tricky. We got to line it up perfectly so our command tank with Vitman can get through here and clear this entire area out. Let's bomb the crap out of that. I love the pioneers. They can one shot those bunkers. Um, let's go ahead and bomb the crap out of that airfield. We'll go ahead and make short work of it because we got our uh, fighter ace up here or our bomber ace. Got the bomber ace. And that's going to be it for another airfield. That is now 12 out of the 18 aircraft we need to take down. All right, so we need to be. We need to figure this out here. Um, I guess we start with that. We don't want our command tank to go in right off because I think we can do a few things without using him yet. And why do you get hit so hard from that? Can we bomb that? Let me try to bomb that. Yeah, we got it. Now, can you do better? No, you can't. You just suck. Should have brought the command tank bro in. I thought I was... I was making a good decision sending you, but obviously you are shit. And I don't know why you should be good. Screw it. Just go. Oh, there's this one firing too. Just go, bro. I'm so disappointed in you right now anyways. Get the command tank in here. That is what I'm talking about. Just everywhere he goes, he levels shit. Just one after another, just absolutely leveling. Oh, I tried to get as many people moved in as we possibly could. We're going to be low here for a while. Oh, sh I didn't know he had... I didn't know. Oh, we're out of ammo. I completely forgot he got to attack twice because he had been one-shotting everything. Shit. All right, well, to the north we go. We got any pioneers up here? This bro's bang. Didn't even need him. All right, so the other airfield we need is right there. Let's bomb the crap out of it. We'll see if there's any... AA around here. No, nope. they were right. I mean, they didn't exactly lie. There was only one AA. That'd be the first time like intelligence was actually correct. The enemy aviation has been destroyed. Soviets still outnumber us yet. At the very least, they can no longer outgun us. Excellent. The Luftwaffe will be able to spread its wings at last. You've, you have used that exact same line before. Get some new material. I've, I've heard that same damn thing. The fear is not going to date you, bro. All right. Advance. Their troops are... are um... Their troops are really weak. Yeah. This is the only good thing about, I guess, the, the beginning of Barbarossa. It's going to let us, like, pretty much roll over all these troops. First day of Barbarossa, and I would say that it was a victorious day for the Luftwaffe as well as the Wehrmacht. They have captured... Uh, breast already and taken out all those airfields. General, I've just been informed that Marina Raskova, the NKVD aviation advisor and an experienced Air Force commander, has arrived in Bielostok for troop inspection. My agents report this is an extremely ambitious and pushy woman who can become one of the pillars of resistance to our offensive. 
We have to get rid of her as soon as we can. Do you know her exact location? According to the latest intelligence, she refused to retreat and remained on the front lines to cover the withdrawal of Russian troops. She pilots a bomber unit escorted by two fighter units. Well, I will tell our aces to begin the hunt. All right, so... They have a lot of planes. I was lied to that if I attacked the airfields that they wouldn't have a bunch of planes. I was lied to. I don't think we're going to be able to get eight more tanks down in the time we got. Holy crap. I just did some reconnaissance and I just found that. Right on our southern flank. What the shit? Well, I, I'm not scared of it. I'm not scared. We're moving right in. It, I'm not intimidated. I know Monstein would be shitting himself right about now. But I am not intimidated. I don't think they will. But imagine. If everything here released at once and all came up to those three tanks, it would be over. I need to break through here before you can move on to Lviv. So for this job, we need some artillery going off. And probably also a, a little bit of luck. Not bad. Yeah, and then we'll just hold right here. Until we know what the hell they, they're doing. Now that I move this guys up... I don't, I don't know, I'm a little bit worried about what happens. Alright, so we got the bros in the south moved up. Uh, I'm really not... I'm really not feeling their positioning, though. You know, I got my... I got my ace bomber here. Let's go ahead and put that down. Shit, why not? Keep it going. Damn, he's still going? How the hell was he able to fire so many times? That's... That's actually amazing. Alright, so we'll be... We should be able to take out these... These two tanks here, right? My bro. My command tank. Yeah, no problem. No freaking problem. Drove them out of the city. Oh, there's three tanks up here. It, all, all I need, all I would need. Freaking, give me, give me two command tanks. And I will win a war. That is all I need. And now that we got that airfield, we can land our, uh... You could land right there. What are you... Oh, it must be damaged. All right, I got you. Like I said, there can be there no go. obstacle to a furious advance of the Wehrmacht. The enemy defense has been breached, General. Excellent, Heinz. Maintain the momentum. I'm trying. My bros just don't have very good movement, though. I love the armored train, even if it's not good against most stuff. I just like having it there. It makes me happy. We got the center taken care of. We need to go up here. Actually, let's do a little bit of recon, see what we're dealing with, and then we will... Oh, they got a tank there, too. 
Yeah, some of these tanks are just there. Now we got one. Yeah, move right up on him. Some of the tanks are crappers. For whatever reason. This bro is not a crapper. This guy's putting in work here. Yeah, there's another tank. We are actually going to be able to get all these tanks out, aren't we? Yeah, that puts us at 5 out of 10. All right, we got one more big gun in the area I want to take out. With the Luthwaffe, so I can leave a few troops behind to clear out these cities. Nice. I should have had more tanks in the north. I'm kind of feeling a little bit naked. I have many tanks up here. Kind of worrying me. All right, June 23rd is a wrap. Day two of Barbarossa. We have got to keep it. This is worrisome to me. That is a lot of tanks. And good tanks too. And my command tank is not down here. All right, bros, I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. I know the first episode, uh, we don't usually get much done because there's so much talking, but we got a decent amount done in two days. I mean, the floodgates have opened and the Wehrmacht are flooding through on at least three bridges, four bridges, five bridges we're crossing. We just got to uh, decide what we're going to do about this. Bros, if you are enjoying this content, you know what to do. Slap a like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will be back here for our next upload. Peace, Brumanati out.